The 2014 poll discourse is only getting uglier. The latest to join former BJP leader Jaswan Singh, who has been expelled for six years from the party over his very public rebellion for a ticket from Rajasthan's Barmer constituency. It is no secret that Rajasthan's Chief Minister Vasundhara Rajay was firm on giving the ticket to Congress import Colonel Sonaram. And in no mood to forget the incident, a very angry Jaswan Singh, who has filed his nomination as an independent from Barmer, has hit out at Rajay saying that since Mar Maharani's don't have moustaches, why did she turn the tussle for the barmaid ticket into a matter of prestige? I don't know that Maharani has a mouth, but why are you laughing? I don't know. But it seems to me that the first thing that was 25 years ago, now it's been cemented by one of them. And it's been cemented by one of them. क्या केवल राजस्थान में एक ही कॉन्स्टिट्यूएंसी है जो भारतीय जनता पार्टी जीतना चाहती है and Dev Ankur Vadhawan now joining us on the story. Dev, uh, the, the political discourse really nose diving and a very senior leader like Jaswan Singh actually making this comment. Do we expect the party, the BJP to react to this statement? Uh, well, uh Sanjana, the reason why Jaswan Singh has reacted uh, has a background to it. When uh, Vasundhara Raji was there in Barmer in support of Sonaram, uh, she did mention that it's a question of uh, uh, of mustaches. Ye mucho ka hai. Those were the words that Vasundhara Raji had used in Barmer. So now, uh, Dave, I'll just have to ask you to hold out. on. I'll just have, uh, I'll have to ask you to hold on there. We also have Jyoti Kiran uh, from the BJP now joining us on the phone line. Um, the, just one Singh coming out and, and making this, this, this rather controversial statement about uh, your Chief Minister Vasundhara Rajay saying that since Maharani's don't have moustaches, she shouldn't have made it about uh, a matter of prestige. Your reaction to it? Is the BJP going to be saying, reacting to this considering that Jaswan Singh was recently expelled and is also a very, very senior leader or was a senior leader of the party? He's an honourable leader and a very seasoned politician. His intellect about the metaphorical use of certain phrases in the state of Rajasthan is beyond doubt. So, uh, I mean, I would not like to question his intellect, though, but he fairly understands that Mooch Ki Ladai is one term which is used here for the war of prestige or, uh, I mean, honor. So, therefore, I find this particular comment gender insensitive, absolutely uncalled for and unnecessary. And we assume that this kind of comments are uh, definitely made out of some kind of desperation. Right. And, and is the BJP going to be taking any action when it comes to this, ma'am? What action BJP can take? I told you that his intellect, I'd not like to doubt his intellect about the state. But certainly the general perception now is this, that these kinds of remarks are not suitable. They are not in good days. And in this particular case, it is very gender insensitive remark. Absolutely, Jyoti Kiran, the BJP leader of uh, Rajasthan, in fact, is saying that the statement made by Jaswan Singh is terribly insensitive and uh, was gender based. And Dev Ankur Vadhavan, our correspondent, still with us on the story. Dev, you were telling us about the statement that was made by Jaswan Singh. And uh, we heard uh, uh, the BJP over there saying that uh, while they don't want to really take this forward, considering that Jaswan Singh is a very, very senior leader, they are definitely uh, saying that this is an insensitive comment made. So really the political discourse as we're uh, you know, just nearing the polls is just getting uglier and nose diving. Absolutely, Sanjana. But if you were to try to understand the political dimension of it, uh, BJP certainly would not want to antagonize the support base of Jaswan Singh, especially in Barmer, any further. Uh, the Rajput community to which Jaswan Singh belongs, uh, it, it has a large number of people which, which still holds sympathy for uh, the former BJP leader. And uh, by trying to, uh, if, if the BJP goes ahead and registers any kind of complaint with the election commission or tries to take any kind of action that can further... Uh, uh, antagonize uh, the supporters of just one thing so the parties are likely to go ahead and do that but uh, as I mentioned uh, this is a this is a war of egos uh, on one side there is the Rajasthan chief minister Vasundra Raja on the other side there is the former union minister a senior leader uh, who has been in the who had been in the BJP right. for several years who has worked with Vajpayee Advani and so and so on and so forth right. so clearly this is a this is a battle of one-upmanship between uh, two stalwarts of Rajasthan politics